Hello everybody, it is I, Super Paul Games, and welcome back to a very exciting time in our Crusader Kings 2 LP. Actually, this guy can go home. That wasn't the exciting part. Where we are getting ready to attack Georgia. We're technically at war with them. It's just getting a big enough army set up to cross there and trying to take one of their holy sites to try and get the five... Tangry Holy Sites. We control two. Our friend and ally and Kinsman controls one. And we're fighting wars for the other two right now. That's one. The other war we're fighting is way over here. I don't know where that guy is going. Gorgle? We're very close on that war. We're at 90% to take the, um... My liege, I've discovered a plot. Yeah, not now, Spymaster. I'm doing a let's play. Sorry. We've taken the Holy Goose Tent here. Maybe the goose pooped there once and they put a tent there? I don't know. Maybe pooped and the tent rose up and it smells like shit. I don't know. How are our laws going? Pretty good. We have low centralization. Trying to manage a huge kingdom. Alright, we're going to have you guys here. I'll merge... And start moving straight across. And I'll probably wait for the second wave to organize here. And then they will follow in your footsteps. Oh, we have so many messages I'm going to ignore. What, am I hitting the wrong button? What the hell is going on there? Oh, I know what I did. My bad. Sorry. I meant to hit control instead of I hit the Windows button. I'm like, what's going on? Because I'm good at computing. I'm a computer internet man. Somebody could be righteously in prison. Oh, it's our whore wife. Oh, that guy loves us. Even though he cheated with our facility, even though he cheated on... He fucked our wife. He still likes us. Of course. We didn't do anything to him. I can arrest this guy. Yeah, we might be done with arresting people for a little bit. We're more interested in this holy war. Now let's get you guys merged up. Your reinforcements are on the way. Sooner or later, we're going to be a little bit in the negative in the war in Georgia, just because of the fact that they're able to defend all their, all their stuff. But it's taking us a while to get our armies ready to go. Because our retinue is way out here in the east... Oh man, we are so close. Like, if we look back in the family tree, he's gonna be like, oh, my grandfather Dongerson the Scholar would be so, so proud. Because I believe Dongerson the Scholar was the one who came up with his own version of the Tengri religion, but now we have to reform it and get it to everybody. Like, that was the most successful king we've had so far. Drislav has just dreamed to be that successful, and in some ways he's been more successful. Oh, so close out there. How long is it going to take you there? April 29th, you will be in... Proshkabada? Alright, you already are in May 13th there. Hopefully you can get there before winter. Might be worth... Oh man, they got guys right there sieging our area. Interesting. Well, once we get these guys together, we'll see about doing something about that. But I want to put pressure on Georgia proper itself. 99%! We're almost there! We just gotta take one more territory, which should take about a month tops. And hopefully then, as long as we don't lose anything, we will get the magic tent! Behold, it's Tenty goodness. Oh, that was the golden Tangra Goose. I don't know if he was golden before. We made him golden now. He's a golden god. He will come down and pay us respect with his magic feathers and stuff. All right, you guys merge. We're just waiting for the last little group to show up. Kind of interesting that they're sieging another holy site.
Let's put our best guys in charge here. Except for the king. We don't want him to get killed. Oh man, I don't know if we want to fight there. Those odds are pretty even. Victory! Excellent! We have won the war in the east. We're going to demand peace. King Drislav of Croatia has usurped the county title of Otuken from Kobayag Bargsgabu. And we won the war? Who's in charge of this? You are, and are you? Who the fuck are you? You're Gnostic? No! Because that's only going to give us a partial control of it. Because, sir, you are not the right religion. Uh, can I imprison you? No. Can I revoke your title? I'm going to. It's going to make people less happy, but we need that. We need to put a Tangri, a good Tangri guy in charge. While we're doing that, let's bring our retinue back. It's got a long ways to go. Um, I'm pretty sure... Oh, he's waiting to see what he's going to do about me telling him he's got to give up his holy tent. You better say yes, I'm going to send my guys in there to kick the crap out of you. Oh, we want to battle somewhere. Now, why don't we move you there, Temper? No, we're going to move you into Georgia. Uh, no, I don't know what to do. We're going to leave you there. Come on, we're waiting for this guy to give up his stuff. May you live harmon in harmony and contentment. I humbly accept your decision to revoke the barony of Cartoon that it grieves, grieves me deeply. We need a Tangri guy in charge. There we go! Hell yes! So you can see it's the green flag now. The moral authority of the Tangri religion is all the way up to 40%. There was a time when it was like down in the teens. That is huge! And actually here, I believe we put um, a Tangri guy in charge there too. That is pretty freaking rad! High Chief has usurped a... Why is that in there? I thought the game was paused. Maybe not. We're going to give this away to somebody too because we don't need Oak Toucan. There's just no way we need this. So somebody who's in my culture, my religion group. Doesn't really matter who. Preferably somebody not too old. How about this guy? I will grant you Oak Toucan. Oh, we got another friend. So close on the holy sites. So that means that four of the five holy sites are controlled by Tangri people now. And we made that happen. Either Drislav himself or his ancestors did. His dad and his grandfather. The Dongersons. And now we just need Itel right there. Your grandfather would be so proud of you, Drislav. Drislav is like, he's not very scholarly, so he probably doesn't understand all the tenets of his grandfather's ideas for reform, but he's the strong martial man who can make it happen. Do we dare do this fight here? How long would it take you to get there? August 10th? That's going to be tough. We're going to try it. Um, our place was sieged there, unfortunately. Now we got to get our retinue back. Our retinue's way out there. <laughs> He's like, I'm coming back. Don't worry, guys. I'll be there eventually. I don't even know who we're fighting. Who in the world is that? I thought they weren't even involved in our war. They're just some general rebels that we murdered on the way back. Well, you know, it's rebels. Why not? We're good at it. Just murder them. 
All right, Georgia is always on my mind, and right now it is under siege. And then more importantly, we're taking the risk here on this battle. Leader-wise, we got a guy with a 14, Braslav, against their guy, Asgabubutfuck, buttfuck, with an 8. They have a leader there with a 0, Elp. We have 11, um, our guy from the barony of Vizolav. And 16 on this side with Donasil against a 14 from that guy. And then part of it, too, matters on troop makeup. We have about the same amount of bowmen. Come on, dudes. If we can crush that army, this could be huge for us. It could also go terribly wrong. Oh, we crushed the flank. Great job. Come on, Georgia. We just want our holy sites. How could you dare stand up to the great Goose Gotengri? You don't even believe in him. I think you're orthodox or something. Oh, we crushed both flanks. Now it's getting gangbang in the center. And now pursuit phase. It's going to be a, that war score, negative two in the lower right. That's going to be positive. Boom. 45%. Baragio was captured. Um, we will actually let those guys retreat as we retake the Crimea, and then we'll chase them down after that. While we are at it, it's funny, I was just about to check it and the Dangerous Faction thing came down. Let us look at the Dangerous Factions. Why don't you like me, bro? I can make you Master of the Blade! It's insane, you're master of the blade. I wrote you a song. So don't revolt. I'm not going to give you money. Nice mustache, though. What about you? I don't think we have any other honorary awards. No. Can you, you want chief gift 20? I'll give you 20 gold. And what about you? You're old. Can I give you an old man award? No, we're out of those. I hate you. I don't know why, but that guy just pisses me off. He didn't even do anything. I'm just like, nah. I hate Chief Moses here. What can we arrest? Our ex-wife. The guy that slept with our ex-wife. This guy. After the Georgian War, I'm for all the wars it takes to root out these problem people. In fact, if anything... Man, I do not know why this guy hates us so much. Let's find out. Because he wants to control area we do. He doesn't like that our guy is arbitrary. He doesn't like our government type. He doesn't like paying taxes. And we must have revoked a title he had at one point. Oh, you're, you're a different guy than I thought. I don't remember you. Wait, was your... Oh, no, it was your dad that we liked. Your dad was super cool. You're a douche. Can I award you a... Oh, grant you an honorary title? No. Send you a gift? 20? That's not worth it. He's still going to be in the negative. We want to be wise with our money. I guess you, old man. What if I give you a little money? Will you shut up? There you go. Hopefully that bought us some time by bribing some people. We're doing pretty good in these wars. I just want to end these wars while we can. Then send everybody home. Alicia, a preacher in the service of Pope Stephanus V, has arrived in Sofia to spread the gospel of their foreign religion. He has little regard for our old faith, declaring it sinful, and he has explained in detail the horrors we shall suffer in the afterlife unless we mend our ways. So, Catholic Church, why are you so interested in converting our area? If your religion is so great, why can't you stay where you are? There are horrors to suffer in this life too, friend. Yeah, the Pope's going to like us less, but I don't care. We did not go through all this work to become Catholic. <laughs> They're going to have to fear the mighty Tangri religion. Soon people around the world, and mostly Europe, will fear and learn to obey the Goose God. Yeah, you stand there and cry, because we kick the crap out of you. My prisoner, 
uh, Sybil Kobiak is complaining about how dark her cell is. That's nice, honey. Why don't you come back to me in about a year when I care? Maybe. Bye. Victory! Alright, we have retaken the Crimea. It's time to crush another Georgian army. We might get some more people mad at us when we revoke the um, Holy Temple, the Bishopric of Sanzik, if we have to revoke it from this guy. Patriarch of Iska, is he like the head of uh, the Orthodox religion? I didn't think they had a proper head. We captured some mayor. That guy doesn't shave. Oh, we're getting so close. Oh, we won a battle down there quicker than I even realized. Defeat! Where? Yes, the rise of the Shia. The Shia are getting more powerful than the, um, the Sunni. Where did those guys come from? That's weird. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, you guys can go home! Sorry about that! Whoever owns those guys, those guys have been up for a long time. Somebody's going to be pissed at me. Oh, they're not so bad. I thought they were going to be super pissed that we had those troops raised since, like, the Independence War with uh, Rome. We are at 49%. If we can just take those things in Italy up here in Georgia, it won't be long. We are about to take their castle there, the county capital. Their castles are cool looking. And there it is, in front of our eyes, the last of the sacred tents. Prince Dongris in the fourth is now of legal age and has become an underhanded rogue. Well, that's disappointing. My son steals things. That's sad. Victory. We're at 60%. That shouldn't take terribly long to take that out. That is super good news. What about down here? Oh, we're getting there. Bit by bit, day by day. How about you, sir? How long till you get back? We're going to be screwed if we ever have to defend that. <laughs> that is so far away. Once we reform the religion, though, we don't need it anymore. It's just about getting enough moral authority where we can convince everybody we are right about the changes to the religion. Man, that's so cool seeing the moral authority up to 40. Prince Superrad of Croatia is now of legal age. He's become a, charis a charismatic negotiator. He's like, I'm proud of that, son. He truly is Superrad. Uh-oh. Dangerous factions... Oh, man, you guys are a serious problem. No, wait. How strong are you? We might have an opportunity here. Can we arrest him? Oh, no. I was hoping we'd have a reason to arrest this guy. Because right now, our retinue are going through that territory. It would be the perfect time to attack him. Like, I've done about everything I can for these dweebs. We just need this war to end. And it will end before too long. I just don't want them to declare a rebellion before that. I don't want them to declare a rebellion, period. But if they do, then we can be like, You unholy bastard sins! How dare you stand in the way of the great Tangri! I thought we all believed in the same goose god. Victory, 68%. We have taken the Holy Temple! The Holy Tent. Same thing. 88 point... Or 88.0%? Oh, 89? You fucking cunt muffins. Somebody became legal age. Can we marry you to someone? Is there anyone we can marry you to for an alliance? Oh, I don't think so. And we're certainly not going to marry you to a family member. That's gross and creepy. You only use family members as concubines. You don't marry them. What? <laughs> what? That's what we learned from... Who was that? His grandpa? His great-grandpa? Someone did that. I tell you, you're getting closer. You're almost there. 
Let's slow down time. Hopefully that'll have us with enough percentage to win it. If not, we're gonna have to come down to Semenda, Semen Land, something like that. No, it wasn't enough. But come on, Georgia, just give it up. You guys can't take the Crimea. You have you don't have enough guys there. You can just stand outside of the tribal area and look in. 90%? Okay, this is getting to be a problem. Uh, can we kill him? I hate to resort to this. We have really avoided this up till now. But we, we definitely need to get rid of this guy who's trying to start, start kicking off independence. In fact, this is going to be the perfect cliffhanger place to leave it. We have... They have 90... 90.2% um, of strength to go against us. Once they get over 100%, there's a strong chance they're going to declare independence, these factions within our own kingdom. In the meantime, we've started a plot to try and kill the leader of the independence faction. He's a royal jerk-off. Really hated to get to that point, but sometimes you gotta do it. And we're still trying to get the Holy Site here. Trying to get the Holy Site before the Independence Faction kicks off. Which could ruin everything for reforming the Tangeri religion. Something we worked at for generations. I will see you all next time. Thank you so much for being here.